stories opened the door to what I thought was going to be a police officer only to get shot four times. I realized that I was paralyzed from that point. I was able to pretend that I was dead and I crawled away thanks to my mom's salsa. I guess what's made us the successful people that we are. Uh, if I hadn't made any that night, I wouldn't have been able to throw those jars through the window. That got somebody's attention to call 911. I was technically dead for 15 minutes. Well, we take our salsa very serious here in Mexico. I started making it in 1984. So do something with it. And <laughs> one night, Roman said he wanted some salsa. And I said, well, I'm not going to go to the store and get you any salsa now. It's too late. My mom says, why don't you make some? She says, well, you have all the tomatoes and chili you know you need. There's onions and everything. Just do it. So I did. And it was amazing. They ate the whole bowl right away. I mean, I made a big old huge bowl of it and it was gone. We thought of marketing it as the salsa that saved Roman's life. Any relations to Randy Castillo, drummer for Ozzy? I ran into him in a music store in Denver, Colorado. And being such a good guy that he was, I reached out and I said, my name's Roman Castillo. And he says, hey, you're the one that's supposed to be my cousin. And I said, oh my God. My embarrassment, I was uh, petrified. I was still holding in a lot of anger. 